Hi, John Malinzek again, here on the series we're talking about the Studio Live AI loudspeakers. Now, again, we talked about microphones, cabling, we're going to talk about the mixer in the next series, but all of the sounds and instruments all come through your speakers. So it's important that you have high quality, great sounding speakers, so the sounds coming out sound exactly like what they do on the field. The Studio Live AI PA does exactly that. And we heard that all summer along with the Blue Devils. We've heard that from high schools across the country that these speakers are the best sounding when it comes to getting an exact representation of what the instruments sound like. One thing that's very interesting in marching audio is that you actually have to blend your acoustic instruments with the speakers. So a lot of times what you don't want to have is the sound of the marimba, then the sound coming from the speakers and have that much different. And you probably know you've heard bands that sound like that. That's not what you're getting here. You're getting a true four-way system with the sub and the top speaker. Inside this top powered box there are three individual speakers two of which are mounted together in what we call a coaxial design, which gives the sound from a single sound point. That's why it actually sounds as clear and crisp as it does. Also, everything's being digitally controlled inside the box. Every speaker is amped individually with the exact amount of power, with the exact frequencies going to it, so all you have to do is plug in and go. Now, when it comes to coverage, they automatically sit in this floor monitor position, so we recommend you sit it right on top of the sub, and as you can see at this school, they just got some ratchet straps and, str and strapped everything down. It's on a great rolling base with eight inch wheels, so you can easily roll it in and out, but one thing you're getting here is a great coverage pattern, meaning when the speaker sits vertically, it's designed to represent 90 degrees wide by 60 degrees tall. When you lay it down like this and point it up, one of the benefits is you actually get 90 degrees coverage so you get sound all the way to the bottom of the stands all the way up top to where the judges are. You only get 60 wide which is beneficial because what you don't want to do is have the speaker sound going into the microphones and creating feedback. So you're always going to put your speakers in front of your front ensemble as much as possible and that way you're not getting any feedback and you're not dealing with that. So now to the back of our speaker system. Now the subwoofer and the top are designed to work together so you can plug in one speaker and just connect audio from the other. So you only have to actually bring out one audio and one power cable. A lot of people like to say that they don't like you know having to run both cables but it's actually very easy to do and the benefits of a powered speaker are really worth it. What we've done is we've taken an audio cable and extension cord and wrapped them together using this product we found online called a cable mesh. This is half inch wire cable mesh. It's expandable so you squish it up, run your cables through, pull it tight, tape the ends and you're done. Now you'll notice I have everything pre-wired back here so all we have to do on the field is run out one cable and simply plug in the audio and then plug in the power and it's all powered from the cart and it's set up. Now I have that audio cable sitting out, it's already plugged into my subwoofer and then I have a cable running from my subwoofer into my top and both power cables are plugged into a combiner here so everything is very efficient. Again, it's really easy to set up, it's really efficient and it sounds amazing. In the next series, we're gonna go on back to our Studio Live AI digital mixer and talk about some of the great benefits that we've found using that and put all of this together.